Out of a developing story near Miami Edison Senior High, where there has been a deadly police involved shooting. Local 10's Christina Vasquez is live with what she has learned. Christina. And new tonight, we are learning a few more details from our review of police radio transmissions. The Figueroa's mother and daughter who routinely walk along its Northwest 60th Street say this neighborhood in Miami is usually very calm in here. Today, as they walked past the remnants of crime scene tape, we're surprised to hear that just yesterday afternoon, we got shot fire. We have one subject with a gunshot wound. Miami police responded to a shooting. There's going to be in the field of the school. In an area flanked by two schools. It's going to be the Edison High School. Miami Edison Senior and iTech Magnet High. Miami Dade Public Schools say no students or employees were involved. A male looks like early 20s. We're trying to apply a tourniquet now when he risked. So, who was involved in the shooting and what were the events leading up to it? Investigators remain tight lipped on those details. You're going to have a kid going show up and through the chest. Police have simply released the following that it was a police involved shooting, one armed suspect died, another taken into custody, and that specific details are being withheld because, quote, it is vital that the integrity of the investigation is preserved. Complaint of sound was 29 at gunpoint by the neighbor and the unit that took arrival just said he's possibly in the area armed. Per an existing memorandum of understanding, the Florida Department of Law Enforcement is investigating this deadly use of force case. Agents collected evidence and witness interviews, telling us tonight the case remains active. And if you have any information about this case to include video, give Miami police a call. Reporting live for you tonight, I'm Christina Vasquez, Local 10 News.